Monterey Jack cheese has been in production since the 1700s, but Schock Family Farmstead is the only dairy that's still producing this cheese right here where it originated in Monterey County. Today we're doing some milking and cheese making. Let's go. Hey John, how are you? Hey Ross, good to see you. You too. Welcome to the dairy. Thanks we'll for get having you, me in. We'll get you in here milking cows before, that's the first thing we have to do before we can make some cheese. <laughs> get some milk out of those gals. All right, I better roll my sleeves up. They'll just get you dirty in that and go at it. <laughs> we brought in some cows here. We're gonna show you how to milk and get your hands dirty and jump right in there. You get in there and just really get these udders clean. We hand individually wash each cow. You don't want any bacteria from your hand on there. And what you do is you will dip them like this. Let that stay on five to 10 seconds. You wipe that off and the cow would be ready to melt. So is it just like it sounds? You just kind of yank on them a little bit? A little squeeze and a little pull down like that. There you go. Woo! Doing some priming here. After doing my part in the milking barn, it's on to the creamery for the next step. Looking for the creamery. Hey Ross, how you doing? I'm good. So we just milked some cows. Is this where we go to make the Monterey Jack? Yeah, you ready to get to work, make some cheese? Let's do it. All right, here we go. All right, Bo, now that we've got our milk from the generous cows out there, how do we turn it into Monterey Jack cheese? Well, of course, it starts with fresh raw milk. I add the cheese culture. And so that's the uh, bacteria that starts that cheese making process, you know, lactic fermentation. For this Monterey Jack recipe, I add the rennet. So this is a real traditional uh, enzyme that's been used for thousands of years, derived from the animal itself, and it helps that milk coagulate. Within a few minutes, that milk starts changing from liquid to something that starts looking like a little bit more like a yogurt texture, essentially a curd. And then you have curds and whey, and I start that uh, cheese making process of heating the curds. So now we're starting the washed curd process. So this is a process real unique to Monterey Jack. Learn to milk cows, met the family, <laughs> learn to make some cheese. Now time to put you to work. All right, let's do it. We're gonna hoop some curds. Kind of push them in there, push down all the little gaps. We're gonna want a nice compact cheese and we'll eventually further press this into a nice wheel of cheese. It's like they say here on the farmstead, it ain't easy being cheesy. After doing my share of hooping some curds, it was on to the aging room. So this is Ty. He's one of the other brothers here in the dairy operation. So tell us about this room we're in and, and what the next step is in the Monterey Jack cheese process. So this is where affinage occurs. Uh, affinage is the process of aging cheese. It comes in here, it goes into brine, sits on these shelves, and it's being taken care of during the aging process. What that's doing is it's promoting uh, the breakdown of proteins, fats and sugars within the cheese, which gives different flavor profiles. And so these cheeses are staying in this room anywhere from two months to, we have cheeses that are over two years old. All this hard work was making me hungry. Well, that was an awesome day, seeing how it goes from the cow and the milk in through the creamery, and now this just gorgeous wheel of cheese. My mouth's watering, man. Can I, can I try a bite of this stuff? Well, you definitely earned the ability to cut into this cheese and try it. All right, here we go. Drum roll, please. Monterey Jack cheese. Still made in Monterey County, where it originated. Oh, <laughs> good stuff, huh? It just doesn't get much better than that. Yep, that's the real deal right there. And you can just taste the freshness. Yep. Raw milk, baby. Mm. So good, man. Thank you so much. Yeah, no, I appreciate it. Thanks for the help making this cheese and milking the cows. Absolutely, I earned that piece. <laughs> yes, yes, you did. Well, I think I might just move on over to the next cow and keep milking this opportunity for some more Monterey Jack cheese. Bye-bye.